Hey stranger, check it out. I have a spaghetti squash. And I just wanted to share on how you prepare this squash. What you do is cut it down the middle like so. And put butter and cinnamon and you put it in the oven. That's pretty much it. You want to cut these edges off right there. It kind of look like a pumpkin um, stem, but this is a spaghetti squash. And it's very easy to prepare, you know, just the things that I told you, three ingredients, tops, you know, the basic. Uh, it tastes like a squash, but when you... Um, you know, put your cinnamon and stuff in it. It has a little sweetness to it. You can salt and pepper this. You don't have to go for that cinnamon flavor. Um, you know, you can leave out the butter. You can just bake it as is. And, um, yeah, to me, it tastes like squash. And you split it down the middle. Cut the ends. At least it stopped right here. And butter, cinnamon, or you can just eat it with salt, pepper. Um, it is just like a regular squash, just comes out stringy. Um, uh, when you when you're digesting it, eating it, or whatever, it it um it will come down to this um, outside peel, and then the meal is over. You can't eat the hug. At least, um, I haven't seen anyone do it. So, yes, this is uh, spaghetti squash. You can use the shell or the um, hug on the outer part as a bowl. You know, um, that's how sturdy it is even after it's cooked. Once again, the spaghetti squash is a stranger babe by stranger. Hopefully, um, I'm sure it's a lot of different other things you can do with this squash but that is one i'm not really big on it but i do like trying different vegetables so this is what's on the menu and um yeah i ain't have to buy it so cool all right stranger babe out bye stranger